Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel! This is Mom Saibel Explains. This video is all about adding integers using algebra tiles. Before we solve any problems involving addition of integers, we have to take note of the following. 1 green square is equivalent to 1, while 1 red square is equivalent to negative 1. When we have a pair of one green square and one red square that is equivalent to zero or we call it a zero pair. Please remember that because we need that one in our examples. Example here we have positive 2 plus positive 3 or just 2 plus 3 that is represented by two green squares plus three green squares. If you're going to count that, that would be five green squares. So our answer is five. Another example, negative two plus negative one. So negative two is represented by two red squares and, and negative one is represented by one red square. If you're going to add that one, that will be three red squares or negative three. Okay, it's so simple, right? Another example, that's positive three plus negative four. Positive three is represented by three green squares while negative four is represented by four red squares. Okay, this time, since we have the both red and green squares, we have to pair them up so that we can identify the zero pairs. Okay, let's have these um, tiles rearranged. So we have one, two, and three. Three zero pairs. So when we say three zero pairs, that's zero plus zero plus zero is equivalent to zero or nothing. What is left is one red square, which is equivalent to negative one. We have the next one. Negative 2 plus 5 is equal to blank. Negative 2 is represented by 2 red squares, while 5 is represented by 5 green squares. Okay, let's find the zero pair. Let's rearrange these squares. Okay, we have two zero pairs. That's 1 and then 2. 0 plus 0 is equivalent to 0 or nothing what is left is three green squares which is equivalent to positive three we have another one three plus negative five plus one is equal to blank three is represented by three green squares negative five is represented by five red squares and one is represented by one green square this time let's find the zero pairs okay we have one two three and four which is equal to zero plus zero plus zero plus zero is equal to zero or nothing what is left is one red square which is equal to negative one see that's so simple right this time it is your turn to solve please write your answer in the comment section the question is which of the following is the value of n n is equal to 15 plus 7 plus negative 8 is it a 30 b 14 c negative 14 and d negative 22. i'll be waiting for your answer thank you
don't forget to hit the like button if you think this is helpful. Till next time!